testing the reversing valve, the first thing you want to do is put your system into heat mode. Putting it in heat mode is going to energize the reversing valve. So I've got my unit in heat mode. I don't have it turned on, so we're not, we don't have a call for heat. On multi-zone, you've got, this is your reversing valve wire, and we've got a Molex plug here. So we can just split that there. And from here, we're going to take our meter, and we're going to test here. We should have, which we do, 230 volts AC. So I know the board is sending power to the reversing valve. So at this point, what you'll want to do is switch your meter to read to uh, check continuity. And now we're going to go in here and check the coil of the reversing valve. You should get between 1.8 and 2.5 ohms. If all of that looks good and you're still not switching over, you know, we're not heating. The one thing that I have seen is that these pins on the Molex plug, I've only seen it a couple times, just make sure that these are seated in properly. So when you plug it in, we've got contact in there. Uh, and that's really, that is the test to test the reversing valve. It's very simple to do. Go to arefco.com for more videos like, subscribe, and check back every week for new videos.